I am back and today I am going to be answering 40 random questions why I get ready for the day. So I already did my makeup off camera. I tried to answer some of the questions why I was doing my makeup but I realized that if I had done that it would have been like a super long video and I didn't want that so I ended up getting rid of the footage. But yeah, a girl glammed up. Oof. She did. She did. <laughs> yeah, so I'm all glammed up. I am going to be creating content for the rest of the day today. So that's why I actually did my makeup. But that's not the point. We're here to answer 40 random questions. And I'm excited. Okay? I am excited <laughs> all right so if you're new hi i'm sam i answer a bunch of random questions that i discover on the internet i also make fashion related shorts and i sometimes upload vlogs on my youtube channel if i am not so lazy to do any of that but um if you're interested in content like these then definitely subscribe and join the community but if you're not so new hey what's up you know the drill let's get into today's video again my questions are from pinterest as always so these are questions they are 40 in total and i'm gonna try as much as possible to answer them as fast as i can so the first question is your name. So I'm not really going to say my government name on here because these are like sensitive information for me. A lot of people won't understand that, but I do know why it's so sensitive for me. So I'm just going to give you like the name that everybody else knows on the internet. My name is Sameto. <laughs> Semera. Semeta, because that's like the way a lot of people call me. Some people call me Semeta, some people call me Semeta, some people call me Sameta, a bunch of different things, but I answer to all of those. So, yeah, but the name is Semeta Loring. That's the name we have on the internet, and that's the only name that you need to know. Okay, next question has something to do with my birthday. My birthday is September 10, hence the reason why I am the way I am. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, my birthday is September 10, so I still have like a long way to go when it comes to my birthday this year. The next one is the meaning behind my username. So I'm going to give you guys like a funny little story. The name Lauren isn't a name I was born with. It is actually from a book. Uh, it is from a book a schoolmate of mine wrote. And the character in the book had like my personality. So a lot of people just started calling me that and it stuck. So here we are. I changed all of my username online to Samantha Lauren and it has just been that way since then so yeah the name Lauren is from a book it's not my birth name so favorite movie I don't have a favorite movie and that is because I'm not really crazy about movies I'm not really crazy about a lot of things in life to be honest but um, I have a collection of movies that I know that I can rewatch. Movies like The Bowtie, um, Corella, Corella, I don't really know. I just recently watched that and it was so cool. I think I liked it because it was out of the norm, but it's not my favorite. I don't have a favorite movie, I just have. And then I love, I like. <laughs> I like wedding year. I like K dramas as well. So, yeah. Um, a fact about my personality. So a lot of people don't know this about me, except for the people who are like in my circle and who are like really close to me. But I am goofy. I am a goofy person. When people get to know me, they realize this. But a lot of people don't get to know this. I am sorry if you hear any background noise. My neighbors, like the other apartment next door from me, someone is about to move in there, so they're gonna be like a bit of noise. So yeah. Uh, 
This question is... I'm just gonna like move around a little bit. Alright guys, so now the top is changed and we are gonna move on. And I'm gonna try to like, you know, find my bottom. I'm not bottom like still. I still have my night stuff on. But we're bottom. We're not bottom lights. <laughs> Anyways, moving on to the next question. Next question is, um, I kind of feel like, I don't know. Well, so, um, what I love the most about myself, I think I like the fact that I don't try to, um, change myself for other people. I'm always me. I like to just be myself if people can accept me for that that's your loss but yeah that's one thing i like about myself i don't try to like fit in the crowd or do the norm or whatever it is so it is really a big thing for me at this point so yeah the next question is uh what i dislike the most about myself to be honest, I don't like the fact that I can come off as possessive. A lot of people don't know this, like a lot of y'all don't know this, but I can come off as really possessive because when I care about people, I just like them being in my space. I like to care about them like a lot. So I can come off as too harsh or possessive or critical or however you want to call it i don't like that but again that's a part of me so yeah i'm gonna have to deal with it all right uh next question is idea of the perfect date for me a perfect date would be a date where the place is quiet and peaceful not a lot of people because if you know me i like my peace and quiet I don't like crowded places so if the place is peaceful and quiet that would be nice and I would like to go on a date where I can actually laugh out loud like just be myself you know because I like the fun things I like to make memories so I want to go on a date where when I'm back I'm reminiscing I'm like dang this was a lot of fun you get it you know what I mean Okay, I'm gonna move around a little bit again, so you're gonna have to bear with me because I need to put my pants on. Can you guys see me? Of course you can. You can. Uh, the next question is uh, weaknesses. I'm not gonna say my weaknesses online just because the internet is a creepy place and there are people who are, I don't know, but yeah, who's gonna use that against me? So. My weaknesses is something you're gonna have to find out. But I can give you one. One of my weakness is laziness. I can be lazy, like really lazy. And that's a bad thing. So yeah, what's that? So I'm gonna wear sweatpants because I'm not going anywhere today. So I'm just gonna be in here trying to make content and all of that. And that is so uncool. Next question is, your sexuality <laughs> I'm a female <laughs> Okay, uh, honestly, I like guys and I don't think that's gonna be Like, you know, but yeah, I'm a female That's my sex or my sexuality if that's what they're asking for I'm gonna have to like oh, I like the fact that this is like the whole I didn't know it was gonna turn out like this. I'm not removing my pajama pants anymore. Just because I look I look really hip hoppy right now. Okay, maybe I might wanna bring this down a little bit to give me that like double waist thing. But yeah, my sexuality, I like male, I like I like guys and I'm a female. I just keep saying this I'm a female thing and it's weird. But um biggest turn on I like someone who is intellectual. That's a turn off for me because I like to have intelligent conversations and like I just like to be around people who keep conversations going. So that's a major, a major for me. Am I being exposed right now? Okay. I feel.
What is this? Okay. Alright guys, now it's time for something really serious at this point. So we're gonna answer like the rest of the question right here. I am ready for the day. I'm ready to move on with my life. Yeah. Um, next question is, uh, last time I cried and why? Um, I cried a few weeks ago because I kind of like was letting someone go somehow. So I kind of cried about it. Like I said, when I care about people, I become a lot more possessive than I should. So I cried over letting a friend go and it wasn't cute. Okay, it was not like the cutest thing ever. But that happened and here we are. So the next question is favorite food, huh? You know, it's weird that I actually don't pay attention to these things. Now I'm answering this question and I'm in my head like, why don't I really care about these things? Like, come on. I like food. Favorite food. What is that one food that I go to when I feel down or something like that? I like cheese pasta. I like a good cheese pasta is it for me, okay? Don't judge me, but yeah, a cheese pasta is it for me. I think it's because now I can't eat it a lot, but uh, favorite season. My favorite season is dry season. So currently I am in Ghana and we have like two seasons and something else. We have rainy season, dry season, and then we have Hamatan. Uh, dry season is my favorite season but it can be really hot and i also like the moodiness that comes with the rain so but dry season is my favorite because if i want to do things i can move around freely so yeah how long does it take me to get ready unlike the average female i when i'm not doing anything related to content creation like makeup and stuff like that i take <coughs> I take less than 30 minutes to get ready. <coughs> I take less than 30 minutes to get ready if I'm not doing anything related to content creation. But if I'm doing anything related to content creation, take between an hour or an hour and 30 minutes. That's because I am not a makeup artist, so I um I try my best to do better when I am doing my makeup the next one is um somewhere i want to visit i just want to visit eastern asia like i really do what languages i speak i speak english that's really sad but i've been trying to learn korean language and i've also been trying to like learn spanish and i have been trying to learn french i suck at it so bad I suck at them all so yeah I speak English for now I'll do better so the color of my eyes I think I have a dark brown eyes or just a black eye I don't know I don't I don't know my color the, the color of my eyes so if you're watching this and you pay attention to me that much and uh, you're most of the time in my space can you just leave a comment in the comment section and tell me the color of my eyes or DM me on WhatsApp or something and tell me the color of my eyes because no, these questions are actually making me realize that I don't really pay attention to myself as much as I should but I think my eyes is that brown last book I read the last book that I actually read was um, Thing like an entrepreneur at like a CEO, that was like the last book I read. Favorite ice cream flavor would be chocolate. <laughs> yeah, I'm not really a fan of uh, vanilla that much. But I used to like, I still do, I like this flavor. Uh, chocolate, cookies and cream. I like cookies and cream. And I also like caramel flavor. So yeah, those are my top three. Chocolate, cookies and cream, and caramel. Uh, dogs or cats? 
I would rather be a dog mom. I'm not really huge on animals, but if I would want to get an animal or a pet, it would be a dog. Because I remember growing up and where I used to live, we had like cats in the house and those cats were a boodle. I have a dog as a pet actually. You'll be shocked. I know someone is watching this video and they're like, oh, Sam, you actually had a dog as a pet? You don't even like animals. Yes, I had a dog as a pet and that because of that dog, that's the reason I don't really like animals, but that's another story for another day. The song I'm listening to right now, um, upbeat music. <laughs> But okay, there's this one song that I'm always playing on repeat. It's called I Miss You. I'm sorry, I forgot the artist's name. I'm gonna like put her name. She's so underrated and she sings so well. I actually got the song from um, Jenny and Georgia, I guess. Yeah, Jenny and Georgia on Netflix. Um, they play it in a movie and I just like felt the need to get the song. And since then, I've been hooked. Okay, that's a good song. Um, day or night. I'm a night owl. I function a lot during the night, but I can be sleepy as well. It's like during the day, I really feel like I don't have a lot to do, but at night, I'm like chopping it up everywhere. So, night. Um, do I like roller coasters? I don't know. I haven't been on one. Jeez. Have I? No, I haven't left the playground that used to be in my neighborhood never had like a roller coaster there. So I haven't been on one. Um, my lucky number, what's my lucky number? My lucky number would be either 10 or 11, between those two. Uh, favorite court, cult. Um, fashion is what you buy and style is something something i'm gonna write it on the screen but it had my favorite quote has something to do with like you know fashion because i love me some good old fashion but um yeah favorite album i don't have a favorite album i'm sorry i listen to music based on my mood i have multiple unnecessary playlists i um don't even do favorite artists all of those things i don't do that like that's how bad my character is i guess so no i don't have a favorite album um <clears throat> what i find attractive in other people like i said i find people intelligence really attractive i find people smile attractive sorry if you have a fetish or if this is gonna cringe you up but i also find people butt attractive i'm like basically almost all the time staring at someone's butt so it's kind of weird but it's my thing um another thing that i find attractive is i said smile is uh people means of actually lighting up a mood in a room that's like really attractive to me someone who can make you laugh without even trying i find that attractive uh what's my type do i have a type <laughs> my type would be someone who is taller than me period yes you have to be taller than me because like I'm already short like why would you be shorter than me but I mean that's not like the big thing for me though but my type would be someone who is taller than me someone who is very I'm big on intellectual I'm sorry intellect I'm sorry um you have to be an intellectual person you have to be able to communicate you have to be an independent person um you also have to be a family person and then you have to be like the list is just so long i can't like say everything but you need to be able to make me laugh that's i'm big on that because i'm already a loner so if i'm gonna be talking to you and all of that you need to be 
an unintentional clown. Okay, you need to be able to make me laugh. So that's that. And you need to be present. Now, it takes two to build or make a relationship. If one person is putting all of the time in the other person, it's just like, oh, she liked me a lot, that's why she's always in my face or something like that. That's like a huge turn for me. So you have to be present in the relationship and you have to put in more time. You have to be committed because I am an all-in type of girl. If I like you, I like you and that's that. Um, nationality. Liberia, Suriname, those are my nationality. I'm West African. I'm from West Africa. Do you have a problem with that? Of course you don't. Favorite song. Right now it's I Miss You, I'm Sorry. <laughs> Favorite holiday? My favorite holiday is Christmas. I don't go crazy over Christmas, but it's just, you know, like the weather change, the atmosphere, like the joy it brings and people are busy doing whatever they want to do, bringing families together. It just makes Christmas my favorite holiday. It's not because I so like crazy about the decors and stuff like that i think it became my favorite because of my dad because that was one of the ways that my dad and i used to like really bond so it became my favorite holiday okay go to comfort food chocolate chocolate is my go-to co coffee or tea i used to like coffee a lot there is still a part of me that likes coffee but i know that my health is important so now I drink a lot of tea more than I drink coffee. <laughs> Place a song that makes me cry. Again, I miss you, I'm sorry, it makes me cry. Ooh, and another song by Torrance Will is uh, Famous For, that's the song title by Torrance Will. It always like put me in this spiritual mood and I always cry whenever I listen to it. Like really listen, pay attention and listen to it. I cry. Um. Places I have been, I've been at my house, I've been at my school, I have been in church, I've been, I've been by the roadside. I am not someone that's gonna come and sit on the internet and be like, oh, I've been to this country, I've been to that country, I've been here, I've been there. No, I'm sorry, that's not gonna happen. Water, fire, earth, or air? I think I answered this in like the previous q and If you haven't watched that, I'm gonna link it in, in, in the description and you can just go and watch that. But like I said, um, earth, cause my sign is like earthy. So favorite color, my favorite shade is black. Again, I said this in one of my previous q and um, My favorite shade is black and I'm attracted to neutral tones as well. Favorite sport. As short as I am, I remember I used to tell people that I play basketball and no one would believe me just because I'm a shorty, but I actually like basketball, it's like my favorite sport and I play it so well, so yeah. Favorite food, that's like the last question. Favorite fruit, I was gonna say is this not repeated? Favorite fruit is watermelon. Alright, so these are questions, these are answers to just like questions about the little things in my life. Um, if you want to be friends with me, you know these things, they're important to me. And I just say if you want to be friends with me, like, am I really that cool? I mean, I am that cool, so. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I feel like a presenter right now, but I'm going to do it anyways, so. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I appreciate y'all and I am going to see y'all in the next one. And I think I'm going to start involving you guys by leaving polls and stuff so that you guys can ask me some questions. So if you have some questions that you actually do want me to answer, then definitely DM me or leave it in the comment section or on my Instagram, wherever you think you can get me, do that. And I will be answering your questions on here. Don't forget to stay true to yourself. Remember to live, have fun, have a good day, and I will see you in another Q&A. Toodles!